In the vast frozen expanse of the southernmost continent lies a secret that has remained hidden for centuries. A secret, so profound it could change everything we thought we knew about. Our world. Antarctica has always held an allure like no other place on Earth. From tales of lost civilizations to rumors of extraterrestrial encounters as the founder of SpaceX Tesla and Elon Musk has long been at the forefront of technological innovation. But what if his pursuit of the unknown has led him to uncover something far more profound than even he could have imagined, now armed with cutting-edge technology and an insatiable thirst for knowledge? Musk has ventured into the treacherous landscape of Antarctica and has uncovered something so terrifying. It's remained concealed for eons. But what exactly has Elon uncovered? And just how much of an impact would it have on our knowledge of planet Earth? Join us on this mind-bending journey as we unravel the unearthly secrets that Musk has recently discovered to be hidden beneath Antarctica's frozen surface, Antarctica, an unforgiving frozen wilderness stands as a solitary expanse of ice on the southernmost tip of our planet. Despite its brutal conditions, it holds the distinction of being our fifth largest continent. Its enigmatic nature has enticed researchers to establish settlements and at any given time, a population of 1,000 to 1,500 people can be found braving its challenges, given its vast size. The fact that it is nearly uninhabitable has long fascinated scientists who believe it conceals numerous secrets. The journey began when a group of scientists stumbled upon a million-year-old DNA sample in the Scotia Sea, situated just north of Antarctica, extracted from the depths of approximately 584 feet beneath the sea floor. This ancient genetic material is believed to have originated from diatoms, a type of phytoplankton. Though the specifics of the DNA remain a mystery, its mere existence was a revelation serving as the catalyst for the notion that Antarctica had undergone a series of dramatic transformations to evolve into its present frozen state. With the discovery of this ancient DNA, the scientists knew they needed further evidence to solidify their hypothesis that Antarctica had once been more hospitable and experienced significant changes over time, determined to find fossils of plant and animal life that thrived millions of years ago. The team embarked on a perilous mission braving the daunting task of reaching the region crucial for their research. They journeyed to South America. They endured a treacherous five-day voyage through the deadly Drake Passage. One of the deadliest seas on Earth undeterred by the challenges that lay ahead. These brave researchers set their sights on uncovering the remnants of a forgotten era, willing to give their all in the pursuit of knowledge as they reached the shore. Their curiosity led them to James Ross Island where their hunting expedition began, weeks passed during which they tirelessly scoured through rocks until finally, their efforts paid off. The scientists stumbled upon a treasure trove of fossils dating back to the late Cretaceous period. Approximately 71 million years ago. These fossils unveiled a mesmerizing collection of marine creatures, dinosaurs and ancient birds. Amidst the astounding findings, they made an exceptional discovery, the fossilized four wings of a beetle species that thrived around 20 million years ago. However, the most extraordinary revelation came when they stumbled upon 50 million-year-old sperm cells adorning the egg case of an extinct worm species. This revelation shook the very foundations of their understanding as it challenged their previous assumptions about the icy desert. Gradually a new theory began to take hold among the scientists. They entertained the notion that this frozen wasteland was once a thriving tropical rainforest, replete with lush vegetation and towering tropical trees. After all, how else could they explain the presence of dinosaurs and bird remains on the continent as time passed? And more discoveries unfolded, doubts gradually dissipated. One such groundbreaking find occurred in 2021 when scientists unearthed an enormous breeding colony of ice fish in the Antarctic wet sea nestled over 400 m beneath the sea level and hidden by the Filner ice shelf. This colony was home to a staggering 60 million nests through the aid of advanced camera systems. The scientists identified the species responsible for this colony as Neopotanoa, a remarkable ice fish. This finding provided further evidence that life once thrived on this frozen planet. In another remarkable discovery from 2021, geologists drilling through the ice stumbled upon an unsuspected treasure, while they initially failed to notice anything out of the ordinary. A scientist reviewing the footage later made an astonishing realization the rock they had hit housed thriving sponge organisms. The existence of sponges thriving beneath the ice sheets was perplexing but the presence of other organisms sharing the same habitat made it even more astounding. The surprises continued in June of 2022 when scientists detected a peculiar groove in the Larsen ice shelf, drawing from their previous discoveries, they suspected the presence of a hidden river flowing beneath the ice. 
They decided to drill through the ice again to confirm their theory to their astonishment, they did not merely encounter a river with a handful of organisms instead, they discovered an entire ecosystem teeming with life. Shrimp-like crustaceans gracefully swam at depths of approximately 1,600 feet below the ice. Mindful of the delicate balance, the scientists observed and studied the ecosystem from a distance, refraining from disturbing its harmony, scientists have long suspected the existence of an extensive network of rivers, streams and lakes beneath the icy surface of Antarctica. However, studying the unique features of this frozen continent presents significant challenges. Their surprising discoveries took aback the research team during their expedition. Contrary to their predictions, the underground chamber they encountered was unlike anything they had imagined. The cavern's roof was rugged and uneven characterized by numerous steep undulations. They made another astonishing observation as they delved deeper. The subterranean water column was divided into five distinct layers each flowing in a different direction. This intricate arrangement added to the complexity of the underground system. Fortunately, just a few days before the catastrophic eruption of the formidable hunger, Tonga Hung Harp Volcano, the team managed to reach the concealed river as would have it. The sensors they had carefully placed on the icy surface registered the seismic waves produced by the eruption reverberating through the hidden cavern. The incredible realization dawned on them that an explosive volcanic event occurring thousands of kilometers away, directly impacted this subglacial chamber buried 600 feet beneath the Antarctic ice. Now beyond all doubts, the scientists knew that the secrets concealed beneath the continent's ice were not limited to organisms alone. And in another groundbreaking revelation, scientists also recently stumbled upon a colossal mountain range concealed beneath the icy depths of Antarctica, stretching an astonishing 1,200 kilometers wide and towering 3,000 m high. This hidden range boasted heights equivalent to one-third of the majestic Mount Everest. Every inch of its surface was veiled in pristine white coat of ice shrouding its true nature from the eyes of mankind. The alluring discovery came to light when scientists detected abnormal fluctuations in gravity, alerting them to the existence of this enigmatic mountain range. Although no one has laid eyes upon this marvel in person, gravitational and magnetic readings provided unequivocal evidence of its presence. The mere notion that such an immense structure lay buried beneath the frozen landscape hinted at a trove of untold secrets awaiting revelation. Given the perilous nature of physically excavating the ice sheets, the scientists opted for a virtual exploration instead. So using data gleaned from the European Space Agency, they meticulously studied the comprehensive gravity mapping of the Earth by employing this invaluable information alongside satellite data, they skillfully simulated the removal of the Antarctic ice granting them an unprecedented glimpse into the rocky terrain beneath within the revealed bedrock. A captivating story unfolded an irrefutable testament to Antarctica's ancient past when it was an integral part of the supercontinent called Gun. Approximately 180 million years ago, united the present-day Southern Hemisphere continents. The virtual extraction of ice divulged the remnants of this bygone era offering a tangible connection to a primordial time. These astonishing discoveries left no room for doubt. The scientists were resolutely on the right path. However, these revelations also raised a pressing question, what cataclysmic events had precipitated these profound transformations? Evolution has left an indelible mark on our planet over the eons and even our dwelling place has undergone remarkable metamorphoses. Yet the extent of Antarctica's metamorphosis demanded an explanation of immense proportions. Two compelling theories emerged from the minds of these scientific pioneers. The first postulated that global climate change triggered the formation of the ice that now enveloped Antarctica. Antarctica thrived in a comparatively balmy climate adorned with diverse vegetation. In era, Preceding the era, the continent experienced average temperatures ranging from 30 to 51 degrees Fahrenheit, hospitable enough for dinosaurs to roam its lands. Even after the catastrophic event that wiped out dinosaurs and other mammals, the continent remained unfrozen. However, approximately 34 million years ago, the global climate took a decisive turn. The average temperatures plummeted by a staggering 5 degrees C instigating the freezing of Antarctica. Though the temperature change may appear seemingly slight, its roots stretch back to the commencement of the Senso era, roughly 66 million years ago. During this period, carbon dioxide levels steadily declined. Scientists deduced that the temperature underwent a chilling transformation. Once the CO2 levels dipped below a critical threshold, this in turn spawned the formation of vast ice sheets and glaciers ultimately encasing the entire continent in a frozen embrace. 
Thus Antarctica's frozen grandeur holds clues to its past and unlocks Earth's evolution mysteries. But despite the appealing nature of the first theory, it lacked substantial evidence. Consequently, scientists devised a second theory proposing that the continent froze due to dramatic changes in ocean currents. This theory suggested that around 35 million years ago, the Drake Passage connecting the southern tip of South America to Antarctica underwent a sudden deepening. This deepening triggered a complete reorganization of ocean circulation, forming the significant Antarctic Circumpolar Current. This newly formed current acted as a formidable water barrier, effectively blocking warmer and less salty waters from the Central Pacific and North Atlantic from flowing southwards towards Antarctica. Consequently, this isolation caused a decrease in temperature resulting in the continent's freezing. Although plausible individually, these two theories were eventually linked by visionaries like Musk and other scientists who believed that this provided the best explanation for the continent's transformation. According to their findings, the deepening of the Drake Passage altered ocean circulation patterns resembling those observed in the Gulf Stream. This shift directed warm waters northwards and caused a change in the ocean currents. As a result, rainfall increased, significantly continuous rainfall plays a crucial role in reducing the carbon dioxide content in the atmosphere through a process known as silicate weathering. During silicate rainfall, eroded rocks containing silicate, trapping carbon dioxide in limestone formations. The substantial drop in CO2 levels became a catalyst for glaciation, turning the continent into a massive ice mass. This compelling explanation aligns with recent climate change observations and oceanic circulation patterns. However, this time, the effects are reversing the events that took place 35 million years ago. In the latter of 2022 both polar regions of the Earth experienced simultaneous and unexpected heat waves. Antarctica's average temperature soared to an unprecedented 8.6 degrees Fahrenheit or 4.8 degrees Celsius. While the Arctic region witnessed a 6 degree F or 3.3 degrees Celsius increase above normal. Additionally, a significant discovery regarding the ozone layer came to light on World Ozone Day in 2022 scientists have since discovered that the Antarctic ozone layer had depleted, creating a massive hole that's larger than the entire United States. Geologists and other experts alike have therefore begun to sound the warning bells that the depletion of the ozone layer may contribute to global warming, which in turn would cause the complete melting of the ice in Antarctica. And unfortunately, an alarming occurrence has already begun to unfold. Recently, scientists made a startling discovery, the colossal A76 iceberg, the largest known iceberg in the world has broken free from its Antarctic shelf and embarked on a drifting journey towards the treacherous Drake Passage. This immense ice formation spans approximately 84 miles in length and 16 miles in width as it traverses its path. This icy behemoth is destined to gradually melt, posing a grave risk of elevated sea levels that could potentially lead to catastrophic flooding. A recent study has likewise brought to light the astonishing retreat of another ancient ice sheet melting away at a mind-boggling speed of 2,000 feet every day. This revelation has offered scientists valuable insights into the potential rapid melting of ice in Antarctica and its consequences for global sea levels in our warming world during the final stages of the previous ice age, sections of a colossal ice sheet covering Eurasia astounded experts as they retreated at a rate, surpassing 2,000 feet per day, a distance greater than the towering Empire State Building. This unprecedented rate of retreat defies what scientists had previously believed to be the upper limits for ice sheet regression. The discovery carries significant implications for understanding the pace at which ice in Greenland and Antarctica could melt, causing a rise in global sea levels by closely monitoring the rate at which ice sheets recede. Scientists can more accurately gauge their contribution to the rise in global sea levels. Since the 1990s, Antarctica and Greenland have experienced loss of over 6.4 trillion metric tons of ice resulting in a rise of at least 17.8 millimeters in global sea levels. Remarkably, these two ice sheets alone account for over one-third of the total increase in sea levels. As the ice sheets retreat towards land, they detach from the sea floor causing them to float and accelerate their flow. This accelerated flow increases the contribution to the rise in sea levels. Consequently, if air and ocean temperatures surrounding Antarctica were to increase as projected matching the conditions observed, at the end of the previous ice age, researchers warned that the ice could retreat hundreds of feet in a single day, triggering the collapse of contemporary glaciers at a much faster pace than previously anticipated. 
But despite this imminent threat to planet Earth, Antarctica remains the hot spot of scientific discovery, and one that's especially full of surprises for context. When we think of deserts, we usually picture scorching hot sandy plains. But would you believe that the largest desert in the world is actually Antarctica? It's a mesmerizing place, incredibly dry and filled with powerful winds. In fact, it receives as little as 50 of rain each year while a whopping 99% of the continent is covered in ice. However, within that remaining 1% lies a fascinating site called the McMurdo Dry Valleys. Venturing into the McMurdo Dry Valleys is like stepping onto another planet. Enormous sand dunes dominate the landscape, reaching up to 70m in height and 200m in width. Though you can't surf down their slopes. These majestic dunes hold immense importance for researchers. The dry valleys possess a climate similar to that of Mars making them a captivating destination for scientists. They believe unlocking the secrets in this region could provide clues about life on other planets. These magnificent dunes are on the move slowly but surely they shift at an alarming pace of approximately 1.5 m per year. And the unsurprising cause climate change as the atmosphere heats up the ice melts and the dunes begin their gradual descent. This realization has prompted scientists to act swiftly racing against time to unravel the mysteries of these dynamic dunes before they vanish forever. But it only gets more intriguing. Scientists have also uncovered that Antarctica despite its freezing conditions harbors one particularly shocking secret volcanoes on Ross Island. There exist four dormant volcanoes, each one holding its own unique story. However, there's one volcano that has refused to slumber, Mount Erebus, the southernmost active volcano on Earth and the second tallest in Antarctica stands at an awe-inspiring 3,800 m tall. Over the past three decades, its volcanic activity has even intensified. Imagine the spectacle of Mount Erebus a natural wonder of extreme proportions. Its fiery heart pulsates with liquid magma while ancient lava lakes continue to boil after an impressive 1.3 million years. Sadly, due to its remote location and treacherous weather conditions, scientists rarely have the opportunity to explore this magnificent volcano. Nevertheless, a brave team of researchers managed to conquer its heights in 2013 through a grueling journey involving traversing snow rocks and glaciers. They reached the summit to their astonishment, they discovered life thriving in the volcano's scorching heat even more astonishing were the thriving microorganisms found in the ice caves? leading scientists to believe that these extreme creatures are among our planet's most unique and remarkable. But scientists have further uncovered something way more unnerving in the vast expanse of Antarctica. One of the continent's icy giants apparently resonates with an otherworldly melody known as the Ross Ice Shelf. This colossal slab of ice claims the title of the largest ice shelf in Antarctica stretching across an area larger than France and several 100 m in thickness. Recently, scientists stumbled upon an eerie secret. The Ross Ice Shelf sings. The haunting melody emerges when winds gracefully dance across the snow dunes of the ice shelf. As the winds sweep through, they generate vibrations on the surface, producing a continuous seismic hum. Unfortunately, the human ear cannot perceive these vibrations, but scientists have employed seismic sensors to capture the mournful tune. This captivating discovery occurred by chance when the sensors were initially installed to observe other phenomena on the ice shelf. As scientists delved deeper into their investigation, they made a fascinating revelation. The song of the ice shelf evolves in response to the environment factors like melting and storms shifting the snow influence the composition of the melody. Now the captivating song has become as a valuable tool for scientists to monitor the stability and vulnerability of the ice shelf in real time. By listening to the seismic humming, scientists gain insights into the changes. Interestingly, scientists have likewise long established that Antarctica, the very continent from which this iceberg hails was once a lush tropical rainforest. One can only imagine the breathtaking sight it must have been. Yet in the present scenario, no one wishes for this ice to thaw due to the staggering consequences it would have on both humanity and the entire planet. As a result, research efforts have been significantly intensified to delve deeper into the factors responsible for the continent's complete transformation by unraveling the mysteries behind this drama shift. Scientists hope to identify proactive measures that can be taken to prevent such a monumental change from recurring. It beckons the question of whether we fathom the possibility of Antarctica once being a tropical rainforest additionally, should we allow nature to follow its course, even if it implies the potential demise of civilization as we know it. Thanks for watching another episode of Voyager while you are still here. Make sure to click the video on your screen for more quality content.